Hey guys, it's me Kate again. So this year is my New Year's resolution tag. So first we have, if you have to choose one word to represent the year you had last year, what would it be? Interesting? Definitely interesting. Because uh, that was the first, uh, 2023 was first year when I was in college, like through the whole year, I started college in 2022, but <coughs> and that whole entire experience was really, really interesting. And then also there are some other stuff, which happened to, uh, towards the middle and the end of the year, that were well, they're also really, really interesting. Uh, not sure how much I want to talk about it, but let's just say it was interesting. And then, uh, let's just say they, I, after the second thing happened, which happened to, towards the end of the year, like in the last two months of the year, figured out that it's somehow uh, somewhat connected to that thing that happened in the middle of the year. Not telling you what the things were <coughs> or why they were connected, but it was really interesting when I figured that out. So, Uh, then we have, what would you choose to represent your goals for the upcoming year? What word would you choose to represent your goals for upcoming year? I don't have really a lot of goals this year. Mostly because a lot of the <coughs> them I'm carrying over from last year. Not because I didn't achieve them, just because they're the same. And... They kind of have, and they're basically all over the place. So then we have how old will you turn this year? Twenty years old. I was born in two thousand and four, uh, and it basically funny story. <coughs> so I was born in the early early morning on the twentieth of February. And basically, uh, my mom, uh, because uh, my mom was in the hospital because of the reasons, uh, the day earlier, so on the 19th, and um, basically my dad was working, came home, fell asleep watching basketball, and... Uh, <laughs> <laughs> he remembers that my mom woke him up because her cons contractions started. So, basically a random story, but... Uh, any travel plans? As far as I know, Vienna in February, but I'm not entirely sure. If you could travel anywhere, where would you go? I don't know. I also don't know. I have three countries that I would like to go to. Four if we count one that's kind of like on the fence. Uh, sometimes I want to go there, sometimes I don't. So three to four countries I want to go to. And um, definitely that those three, like, if we don't count that country, that's a maybe. Those three are really off into the future because at this moment, I'm not entirely sure how, is, how much is it possible for me to go there, so. Then how if you could change any bad habit, what would it be? I honestly don't know. Name a trend you'd like to see continue from last year into this upcoming year. Uh, this something I'm 
I started doing it last year towards the really in like last two months that I don't want to share share just because it's really really random oh. when it so uh, then we have what was uh, what are official colors of this year show us something new on with those colors uh, I don't know like this year is year of uh, uh, really funny stuff we'll see I'm the, in the summer something is happening which <coughs> I'm hoping does go well <coughs> now I'm not going to talk about it uh, what it is but color uh, that kind of time the ties to the colors of the year and uh, when it comes to showing you something with those colors I currently am not entirely sure where that thing is because it can be in two places both in my closet because that's just where I keep that thing but uh, one is not easily accessible so and then what change you would like to see made to your home I honestly don't know as you can see last the, now already last year we changed the, the couch uh, mind you the old couch was good still but it was slightly on the older side so it wasn't the newest model and basically we always want to get uh, this style of the couch uh, because the old couch was slightly um, impractical for uh, for me and my parents it used to be when we bought it it was really great because mind you that uh, couch was what I was still in elementary school or middle school so then it was great. Uh, in the last few years it became so really impractical mostly because first of all we all uh, when we're at home we're all in the living room most of the time on the couch and with me going into high school and uh, everything that happened uh, since then it became too impractical for us so we got this one so I don't know for the next year but definitely this ha I'm happy this happened so and then what is your new year's resolution I don't have any that's kind of notable I have a multiple smaller ones that are kind of just like keep in mind for keep in mind them in mind but nothing so this is it for this you like like if you like it please like share and subscribe down below my social media my email and some other stuff i'll see you next one